Good morning. All right. I promised yesterday that I would make a video for somebody's how how to remove the center console in '93. This is '92, but it's they're all basically the same. So I'm going to show you where the mounting bolts are. are. And it's really not ter terribly difficult, but there are some steps you need to take. Inside here is a seven millimeter bolt. Not nine times out of ten, they're broken off there. There's another one, a corresponding one, on the opposite side. To start, you're going to want to chalk your wheels or apply your emergency brake or do both. Turn the key to the off position, step on the brake, and shift the car into neutral or however far down you need to go. You're going to remove these two screws and you're going to remove the shifter handle. There's a, a slot on the front of the shifter handle that you can feel with your finger. I can, I'll just show it to you. It's right there. See that slot? There's a clip in there. Uh, a pick will get it out. A small screwdriver, a small head screwdriver. You pull the clip out and then just pull the handle off. Once you got those out, you're going to come back here. You're going to take the you're going to take the lens out. And then you're going to pull the glove box out. Whenever you take, the, when you put this back in, you have to, as you can see, it's difficult to come out. And start. You have to put the back in first. Otherwise, it will not go back in. Once you've got that out, underneath here, there are three 10 millimeter nuts. Sometimes there'll be one missing. It's, it's very common that there's only two, but there should be three. I'm looking for the third one now. Look at my finger. I only feel these two. I look at. I have a console out. We'll look at. Take a look at that. But this one only has. Seems to have two. One may have broken off. Uh, this car is relatively complete so I think that what we're seeing is what what's here but as I said take the shifter off once you get the, those three out of the back you can lift the, the entire assembly slide it back and it'll come out of the car so it's basically just those bolts that I've already showed you If it's broken across here, Tom, across the front, that's that's a difficult repair. Uh, there are two little hooks under here, which I'll show you on the one that I have out, where it just slides up in there. But basically, you're going to have to take the, shift, the shifter out, those two screws I showed you there, three 10 millimeter nuts in the back, and then you just lift it up, slide it back, and take it out. Now let's go look at the one that's complete. I use this car just because it's got a light interior and the console I've got is black. So here we are. These two plastic screws slide up in. In order to get them out, as I said, you got to take out to in here, take the glove box out. I'll just show you from the outside. Be easier. And there are four studs. One, two, three, there are four. Okay? There are four studs that hold the the back of the that's all together. As far as repairs go, I've been using uh, 
this one I did previously, so it's not it's not as reinforced as I wanted. I just used Gorilla Glue in this in all the the channels on the sides. The hardest part is when it breaks across the front here, because this metal piece that hooks on is actually screwed to that. So if it breaks in here, it's difficult to repair. Other than that, I mean, that's pretty much what you got. What I have found, and I've been using quite a bit lately, is baking soda and cyanoacrylate crazy glue, but you need the liquid. And it seems to adhere very well if you just clean this up with the uh, acetone first, just to give it some bite. But it hardens instantly, so you have to keep that in mind as well. I hope this is of some help. This isn't a 93 console, but it's basically the same. Like I said, shifter out, two in here, four in the back, slide it out. Take a picture of it when you get it out. And uh, like I say, if you need any dimensions, width, or height, or anything like that, just give me a holler and I'll get back to you. All right, take care.